Okay, so it's time for the version 2 of this uh, solution sa uh, SDOF systems. Now, what I've done here, I reduced everything in terms of uh, in terms of uh, yung mathematical na lang na kwan. Uh, we'll just uh, be solving a mathematical problem here. And to din siyang gamiton din ng kwan mga pamagi yun sa ano siya. Okay? So, I go back to the original differential equation of motion ani siya fundamental niya na expression that is kx is equal to f of t okay so another condition that i forgot to write down is equal to zero claro ba okay now this is equal to zero this is equal to zero so i will have m double prime plus kx is equal to zero now I substitute uh, M with 5,000 plus K din ako diri 47232 that is equal to 0 now I hope maklaro pag yapon siya ang numbers anyway ako ni siyang ikuan i-apply na kung Laplace transform operator ani equal to so what you do with one equation you do uh, one part of the equation you do to the other okay, para ma maintain yung quality excuse 5000 I can factor this out this is the beauty of integral operators like uh, Laplace transform or Fourier series integral transforms man siya. so on say properties sa integral more gap na siyang iyang kuan din eh ang iyang batasan so hmm. zero e kuan pa na ko igawas ng zero is the still zero gap na siya and i have uh, 5000 gani ba but i need to define unsa ang kuan ang laplace sa tuang second derivative og sa tuang kini ba before ta mo kung ano siya, i-remanipulate na to siya. We have to keep in mind that, uh, kanisya diri, this is actually equal to S squared F of S minus uh, S X sa X O siya and then minus initial na kung ano ni. This is yun sa F of S simply. Okay? But we already know that this is equal to pila. Kanisha, this is the initial condition. So, muna siya may musik 250. And this becomes on sanapod. 50. Okay? So, ako rin niya siya i-rewrite ang equation na to. Ako rin siya i-plug in dito. And I will have another kona sa da yun. I don't know if makita siya dia dapat no dili siya makita uh, dapat move ko gamay mm, okay so I plug all of this in ni siya ana to sagol tanan mm. this is unsa 5,000. Take note, akong kichange ang color sa akong pen kay para makuan sa din eh. Mabantayan ninyo ang change in domain from X to S. Lahat na itong mga variables din eh. Uh, Kani, this is S squared F of S minus uh, this is 250 S minus 50. Na siya. Next then, we have um, 47232. And this is unsa? F of S. Okay? So, klaro pag yapon siya. And that should be equal to unsa nasad. Okay? It's equal to zero. Ba? Oh, so.
Tuwa na rin siyang kanon din. Ah, dula, dulaon pa siya. So, I divide everything by 5,000. So, this becomes S squared F of S minus uh, 250S minus uh, 50 plus 47232 divided by 5,000. Zero. Okay? Now, ako na siyang ikuha nasa di, dula-dula nasa nato ni siya, plus 47232 divide by hmm. So, this is equal to 250 transposed into plus 50. So, we have uh, something like this na din expression. Now, Ako ni siyang gusto ikuan, i-encapsulate sa na ko siya niya, ako rin siya i-edit na po. This should be equal to 250S plus 50 divided by this ikuan. Uh, divided by, I think this is uh, 25. Hmm. Kanina dah yun, ba? <laughs> I just hope nang kaya pa rin yun eh. Ako nasa din siyang ikuan. Um, ibungkag ta ni siya. Kay medyo labad sa ulutan aon. Um, 250 akong i-factor out. I will have, kung nasa S S squared Square root of 41, 25 squared, ba? Plus, um, factor out now is 50. Um, magdagdag bawas din ko diri. Tsada mo ng dagdag bawas. Mm, 12 over uh, square root 41, 25. Divided by S squared times um din sa dini. So, nothing nga niya klaseng expression na po. Diba? Now, ako ano siyang gusto yung muna ni siya. Ibalik na po na ito siyang usas sa una. Ba? We cannot say as yes, kuan lang. Kani, this is an incomplete form ni as yung solution. We need to go back sa yung original variable which is terms of x. Now, ako na sa din siya apply ang kanina klaseng transformation niya. So, from the Laplace, we reverse the process to the inverse Laplace transform. 250 can be factor out. So, dili kayo na siya labad sa ulo. So, S divided by S squared I hope maklaro pag yapon. Tinsay na lang ko ninyo. I love Laplace transform. Okay. <laughs> Tsada pa kagod niya na kuan. Na mathematics. Uh, very powerful na kuan. Method para mag-solve, mag-dilog. Differential equation. So, if possible, uh, Tsada magya po na siya na mental exercise. Although, if dili kay nga naka-anad. Kulang kag-practice ma. Balintunggit ka every now and then. <laughs> okay. Um, Asa na gagawin to the pit? Hmm. I go back to the original variable na din. Ano siya ha? And this is equal to... Okay, tapa ba? Okay. Uh, X t is equal to... 250. And this is... Cosine... I think this is uh, 3 point something. Ba? 3 point... Zero seven three t. Hmm. Um. Plus then should delete. 
50 divided by kani din siya. Mumani siya yung decimal form niya. This is sign. T. T. So, okay. Amalay, mamawala lang yun. Pares na sila yun. Akong napalabas ang kanisya na formula using the plus transform. So very same equation na gapon. Very same expression na gapon na itong ganiya. Okay? So, you can use Laplace transform as a way of uh, reviewing your answers. If sakto ang inyong gikwanda ni. Eh. Ba? Although, mas tasa na process. Mas madugo ang laban niya. Pero, kanyang gapon. <laughs> ba? It's about learning how to love eating veggies. So, yun nga na gapon na siya. Itong mga bata. Bata, di taganag mga kagutan kayo. Okay? Uh, pait doon sa ba pero in the long run it's still good for you ba hmm. so when I'm solving a uh, differential equations or sa kung saan classing problem if I can find a way to apply Laplace transform I think mas mas simplify akong labad sa ulo na okay I hope it works works for you pod so kamo na iba lang sa nyo kwa na anyway this is just an alternative na kwa solution to this uh, problem kamo na bala you be the judge if you have any questions, comments, or uh, just feel free to write something on the post or you can send me a message. Thank you for listening. <clears throat>